prove that the set of all rational numbers between 0 and 1 inclusive is countable. Let's go ahead and work through this. So proof. So the way to do this is to create a one-to-one -one correspondence between the natural numbers. So if we can create a one-to-one -one correspondence between the natural numbers and the set of all rational numbers between 0 and 1 inclusive, then we've shown uh, that this set is countable. So I'm going to uh, try to explain it with a picture first, and then I'll say some words. So here we have the rational numbers, and here we have the natural numbers. And so the first rational number that we'll deal with is 0, and we're going to send that to 1, which is the smallest natural number. And then 1, we're going to go ahead and send that to 2. And then now we're going to do the following. We're going to consider all fractions with a denominator of 2. Then we'll consider all fractions with a denominator of 3. And then all fractions with a denominator of 4. Then all fractions, etc. So we're just going to go down the line and consider all such fractions. The thing is, we are going to ignore equivalent fractions, so we're only going to count them once. So for example, 1 half is the same thing as 2 fourths, which is the same thing as 3 sixths, etc. But we're only going to count it once. We're only going to count 1 half. So let's start now with all of the fractions with a denominator of 2 where we don't count equivalent fractions. So we have 0 over 2, which is 0. We have that. We have 1 over 2. We will send that to 3. And then we have 2 over 2, but that we already have 2 over 2, it's 1. So now let's consider uh, all fractions with a denominator of 3. So 1 over 3 would be a choice that we haven't already used. So we'll send that to the number 4. And 2 over 3 is another valid choice that we haven't used. That's why there's no ambiguity, right? We have to throw away those equivalent fractions, only use things once. And then 3 over 3 and 0 over 3, we've used those already. Let's do 4. So 1 over 4 is okay. So 1 over 4, uh, that corresponds to 6. And 2 over 4 is not okay, because 2 over 4 is 1 half. We've used that. And then we have 3 over 4, and that will go to 7. So you see we've developed this... This mapping, right? We have a mapping that sends rational numbers to natural numbers and natural numbers to rational numbers, and the mapping is a bijection. So we have a one to one correspondence, right, between these two sets. So thus, we have a one to one correspondence. Right, really, really nice uh, between, you know, the set of all rational numbers. Uh, between 0 and 1 inclusive and the natural numbers. So, so the result is proven. I'll just say that. So the result is proven. So I hope this video uh, has been helpful uh, in some way. Kind of a cool idea. Good luck. Take care.